Hey, it's Bridget with Sleepopolis, and today I want to go over our top picks for the best natural sleep remedies on the market. Organic sleep remedies can be a great way to catch some Z's if you want to avoid pharmaceuticals or tech-focused aids. They've also been used for centuries and can be safer and cheaper options than over-the-counter medications. If you want to learn more about any of these natural remedies or see more options as we go through this video, just click the link in the description below. You can also head over to sleepopolis.com for more sleep health content. But for now, let's get into it with our top picks for the best natural sleep remedies on the market. I do want to mention, if you feel you may be suffering from a sleep disorder or other medical condition, you should see your doctor or healthcare provider, as these videos are meant to be informative but do not take the place of medical advice. First up is ashwagandha, which is Indian ginseng and winter cherry. It comes from a small evergreen shrub found in India and parts of Asia. Some research suggests it can help people fall asleep faster, spend more time asleep, and improve sleep quality. It works by promoting relaxation. But there can be side effects like diarrhea, nausea, or vomiting, and in rare cases, liver problems. You can find ashwagandha capsules pretty easily at the store or online. Doctors recommend taking 600 milligrams for sleep. Okay, next up is magnesium, which is an important dietary mineral. Magnesium glycinate is the specific form of magnesium shown to help with sleep. It affects the nerves that stimulate our muscles and promotes muscle relaxation. It can also help relieve anxiety, promote bone health, and boost exercise performance. Side effects are rare, but some people may experience nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, or upset stomach. You can take magnesium as a topical or in supplement form. All right, next is lemon balm, which has been used since the Middle Ages. Lemon balm is a member of the mint family and has been used to treat anxiety, improve mood, and help people fall asleep. There's a lot of research backing lemon balm, with one study finding it effective at reducing both anxiety and restlessness. It can also help improve appetite, release gas and bloating, and treat insect bites. Side effects are often mild and can include nausea, dizziness, wheezing, or increased appetite. It can be taken in tea form, and doctors recommend drinking it about 30 minutes or so before bedtime. Another tea you may be familiar with is chamomile. Chamomile is a popular medicinal herb that's been around for centuries. It's a member of the daisy family and can help relax the body and encourage sound sleep. Several studies have shown it helps sleep quality of postpartum and elderly groups. It can also help with nausea, vomiting, heartburn, and skin irritations when used as a topical. Side effects are mild, but it can cause drowsiness, as expected. Doctors recommend, again, drinking this one about 30 minutes or so before bed. All right, next up is tart cherry juice, which has become really popular in recent years. Tart cherries are rich natural sources of melatonin, which is a hormone that's been shown to help you sleep. There's been very limited research on tart cherries' impact on sleep, but a small study in 2018 did find it improved sleep among older adults with insomnia. Tart cherry juice is high in antioxidants and can offer protective benefits to brain cells and help reduce muscle soreness. A possible side effect is diarrhea. You can either drink tart cherry juice or take it as a pill supplement, but it may take a week or so to start seeing the effects. Next up is valerian root. This has been used as a medicinal herb since ancient Greece and Rome. A lot of people take valerian root in tea form to reduce anxiety and to relax the body. A recent study found it can be a safe, effective herb for promoting sleep. It works quickly and can also help with premenstrual syndrome and menopause, headaches, and depression. It does have a bit of a bitter taste, and side effects can include headache, excitability, upset stomach, dry mouth, and a sense of unease. Similar to some of these other natural sleep remedies, you can drink valerian root tea about 30 minutes or so before bedtime. All right, now for the last pick on this list, lavender. Lavender is super popular and has been used to treat anything from topical burns to poor sleep. Studies have shown it can enhance various aspects of sleep, including latency and quality. Along with potentially helping your sleep, lavender can help with anxiety, depression, pain, and inflammation. Side effects include diarrhea, headaches, and constipation. 
Lavender essential oil is very popular, but you can also take it as lotions, capsules, teas, room sprays, candles, and more. In fact, we've even reviewed a mattress that had lavender infused in it. All right, that's all we have for today. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you wanna learn more about any of these natural sleep remedies or see other options, just click the link in the description below. Also keep in mind, it may take several days to see the effects of these. Head over to sleepopolis.com as well to see more sleep health content, but hit that subscribe button before you go to see more videos like this one. Bye.